Hey everybody, welcome to the Kids Book Club with Jamie Lee Curtis. She's telling everybody about her brand new book, This Is Me. You guys excited? Yeah! How about a nice alligator round of applause? Three, two, one. That's pretty good. I like that. I'm so happy to have Miss Curtis here. She's written 11 children's books. And this is your latest one, This Is Me. Tell us a little bit about okay, this, this one. This is so great. So all of us are immigrants. Most people in America, their ancestors came from another place. And they moved away from their families, they moved away from all their friends, all their possessions. And they took off in just a small suitcase. And so the question that a teacher in the classroom in this book poses to her students is, this is the suitcase that my great-grandmother came from China when she was seven or eight years old. And then she gives this suitcase to each of the students in her classroom to think about what they would take. And here's, here's what she says to the class. How would you know, in this case, what to pack? That once you had left, there'd be no coming back. So you, my dear class, have big choices to make when you bring this case home. What would you take? My Groucho Marx glasses, Weird Al sign CD, <laughs> my Notre Dame jersey, and my karate gi. And then the book has, at the back of it, a suitcase. I remember being a kid and they would ask us if you could take just a small suitcase, the same kind of thing, mm -hmm. what would we take? And I've thought about that ever since I was a kid and it's such a great thing to talk about at the dinner table. And this is such a great idea for a book. Thank you. Can you guys each think of one thing that you would want to take? Yes. My phone. Okay, your phone, because you're a modern girl. But remember that all of these people came from a time before there were even any phones, let alone these small smartphones. I take my guinea pig. What's your guinea pig's name? Albie. Albie. So Albie would fit in there, whereas like somebody's cat or dog wouldn't. Um, I would take a like a small photo album and take a picture of everything that I have. I would take my, my glasses and my candy. What would you take? Well, the first thing I would take is the necklace that I wear, which actually has my children's names on it. I have a photograph from my wedding where it has my entire family in it. And you'd have room for a couple of Harry Connick Jr. CDs. Absolutely. Or an iPod. Yeah. With Harry Connick Jr. Then you can take them, take them all. Them. And what about the two quiet people? Can you money. think of something you would take? Money. Because when you got to the new land, you'd need money. The quiet ones always take cash. That's what, <laughs> that's, that's what I've learned. And that brings me to the last point, which is everybody owes Jamie Lee Curtis $16.95 for this book. No, stop. Joke. He's joking with me. How much do we love having Miss Curtis here today? Was that awesome? Can we give her an alligator clap? <laughs> All right. Hey, on the count of three, say thank you, Miss Curtis. One, two, three. Thank, thank you, you Miss Curtis. Curtis. Her new book, This Is Me, in stores now.